Please allow me to read the history of the Philippine independence. So the Philippines gained independence on July 24, uh, July 4, 1940. No. 1840. I'm sorry. Through to the signing of the Treaty of Manila with the United States, who had annexed the Philippines as a territory in 1898. While at first the U.S. intended the Philippines to be a colonial property, conflicts in the Philippines caused the U.S. to become more inclined toward Philippine independence. Philippine independence had been sought since the mid-19th century. During the, 19, uh, the 1898 Spanish-American War, Emilio Aguinaldo led a band of rebels to oust the Spanish rulers. Though Aguinaldo declared Philippine independence, the island nation was formally annexed by the United States in the peace treaty that ended that war. At first, the United States wanted to maintain the Philippines as a colonial territory, but the fractious Filipinos rebelled, drifting from a conventional war to a guerrilla conflict in which they had the advantage. So in 1900, the, the United States established the policy of attraction, which is a campaign intended to win hearts and minds by allowing the Philippines a large degree of self-governance. However, America's 1916 Jones Act promised eventual Philippine independence, and in 1935, the island nation became independent, uh, it became an independent commonwealth. The Japanese attacks during World War II interrupted uh, interrupted the move toward independence. Nevertheless, it finally was granted after the war. So that's the history of the Philippine independence. Thank you. So back to Ma'am Maribel. Thank you, Madam Denden, for reading us the uh, independence. So, with the OID, Sumarunong.